Are you a seasonal visitor or new resident here in Naples, Florida and looking to find new friends? I'm Kim Mainkhorst, host of Lavish Living in Naples, and in today's episode, I'm gonna go through different ways to meet new people. No matter how old you are, meeting friends in a new city is hard. Kids have an advantage of going to school where they're surrounded by social interaction, but that's not the case for us adults. The good news is most people moving to Naples have been transplanted from all over the place and they're in the same boat as you. You just have to know where to find them. When I personally moved to Naples, I literally didn't know one person within hundreds of miles. I wasn't overly outgoing back then either, so I used a few different methods to meet my now lifelong friends. Number one, through work. This one's obvious if you do work. It's a place that you go almost every day and often workplaces organize social gatherings and such to welcome new employees. If not, be sure to go out of your way to introduce yourself personally to your fellow staff members and prepare a list of your favorite activities or interests if you're asked to introduce yourself. But what if you aren't working or you're only here seasonally? The rest of my list will be geared towards you. Number two, your neighborhood. You may have a community center and amenities right in your own neighborhood. Most gated communities here in Naples do. Sometimes communities have a full social calendar, especially during season. There are theme nights, formal events, sports meetups, or even just casual get-togethers by the pool. If you're looking for more ways to meet people, go to your gym, the swimming pool, or go for walks and be social when you see other people out. Trust me when I say it's really convenient having friends where you don't even have to leave your own neighborhood. Number three, private clubs. If your community doesn't have the amenities that you're looking for, there's also private clubs where you can buy memberships and connect with others. There are beach clubs like Barefoot Beach, Naples Grand, and La Playa where you can buy memberships to enjoy their amenities and dine and play on the beach. Then there's others that offer resort style amenities and opportunities for events to connect with other members. And of course, there's yacht clubs and golf and country clubs to join where you can get on tennis and pickleball leagues. If private clubs aren't your thing or you want to meet even more people, all of our local parks offer leagues as well. Every morning you can find dozens of locals mingling over a friendly or not so friendly game of pickleball. Number four, social groups. The good thing about technology and the internet these days is that you can find a group of people with similar interests as you. Whether you like to kayak, go bird watching, paint, or just drink wine, there's a ton of options of places to connect. So in this category, I'm going to break down a few of these groups. Facebook groups, sports and sports clubs, a gym or workout class, and meetup groups. Anything you can be interested in, there's a group on meetup.com. You don't just have to join a group and hope to find someone like-minded. Now you can actually seek out activities that fit exactly what you're looking for and wanting to do. Number five, social scenes. Maybe you're just a social butterfly and can talk to anyone. The good news is that Naples is very easy to connect and make conversations with strangers. Most people are in a good mood living or visiting in our tropical paradise and they're open to chatting. If you're one of those people, places like the Mercado and Vanderbilt Beach Road and 41 is a great place to see new faces and meet friendly folks. Here you'll find a plethora of dining, bars, retail, and more. In fact, I have a full video on the Mercado, which you can check out in the link below. Or maybe you're just someone who loves the downtown vibe. Fifth Avenue and Third Street are always hosting events that draw crowds and make it easier to connect with people. And last but not least, number six, places of worship. This one is obviously a very personal choice for each individual, but there are a lot of local places of worship for all faiths, which provide classes, gatherings, and a space where you can really connect with like-minded friends in a more intimate setting and really get to know one another. No matter if you're outgoing or shy, there are options for you to make lifelong friends here in Naples, Florida. So don't just sit on the beach by yourself unless you really want to, but take some of my suggestions above. Get out of your comfort zone and go meet some new people. You just never know if your new best friend is right around the corner. Thanks for watching today's video. If you're looking for fun things to do with your new friends, check out my top 10 things to do here in Naples, Florida video. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video.